I'm Martin Imans, I'm the founder and CEO of the company. I founded a company when I was 20 years old uh, in Croatia, uh, which was a pretty, pretty wild ride. The idea I always had was, how can you make uh, an electric car that's not only environmentally friendly or saves energy or whatever, but makes cars exciting? So using the technology um, of electric propulsion, not just to um, improve the efficiency, but actually make cars better for enthusiasts like me. Because in the future, we don't want people to think that only old cars uh, were interesting or exciting, but to make people excited for the future, to look forward for better cars. And that's what we are doing here uh, with our own cars, but also using that technology then to trickle down to the cars of other manufacturers. Um, so basically what we have here is the world's most powerful car, regardless if electric, combustion engine or hybrid. 1,014, sorry, 1,914 horsepower. It's also the fastest accelerating car in the world with less than two seconds, zero to 100, and less than 8.5 seconds on a quarter mile. So what would be hard to imagine just like five, six, seven years ago, that an electric car is faster than any combustion engine car, that's now reality. And that's what we are about in Rimac. We are about bending the laws of physics. It's also the fastest electric car ever. This particular car, which is actually a prototype, uh, broke the world speed record for the fastest electric car just a few months ago with 400 kilometers per hour, 412 kilometers per hour in Papenburg in Germany. You can see some of the shots of that here on the screen. And that makes it the fastest electric car in the world. Um, and you can see this car is pretty beaten up. It's not, um, yeah, it has a little bit of marks everywhere. It's authentically being used for testing um, in a lot of places. And what's important about this car is that everything is developed by us. So all the technologies there are developed by our team in Croatia. And we also produce most of the car in-house. Um, and then we use this technology to help other companies go electric. So one of our partners is also Porsche. They are one of our big investors, uh, hold 20% of the company. Hyundai is another uh, of our investors. And we work with a lot of other car companies in the world, helping them to make electric and hybrid cars. So we are developing and making batteries, power trains, and other components for them. So basically showing with the Nevera what is possible, and with our own cars showing what the technology can do, and then helping other companies uh, to implement the technology to higher volume, so that this technology can end up in other cars. One of the special things about the Nevera also has four electric motors, one for each wheel. The rear motors are completely different from the front ones. And we are controlling the car, uh, basically each wheel separately, a hundred times per second. In that way, we can control the car like no other car can be controlled. It can be super precise on the track, if you choose the track mode. Uh, no slip, no oversteer, no understeer. And if you just change the mode, uh, for example, to drift mode, you can do crazy stuff like we see Chris Harris here doing, uh, drifting like no other car can drift. Uh, you can have only front wheel drive, only rear wheel drive, anything in between, and adjust the car exactly as you want it. So this is an electric car made by enthusiasts, made by people who love cars, but proper car guys, to show that electric cars can be really, really exciting. So. The car went through a proper uh, development testing program and as the company was growing so, or as the project was progressing, so was the company progressing as well. So from zero people in 2009, when we started to develop the car five, six years ago, we were maybe 200 people. Now we are 2000 people. And of course, uh, you might know that also since 2000, uh, 2021, also Bugatti is part or of the of the company, or we are now one company, Bugatti and Rimac. Uh, the company is now called Bugatti Rimac, where we develop uh, future Rimac cars and Bugattis in one company. And the approach we did with Nevera was not that it's a garage project and not just fast, but we wanted it to be really uh, exciting, also technically, and a proper car. So it's comfortable, it has space, 
uh, we crashed 11 cars in crash testing for this small volume that we will produce um, because we wanted to be really high quality, safe and uh, have global homologation certification uh, in the US, in Europe. So we didn't take any shortcuts, we did it really properly. It also has some interesting features like the driver coach. So the car has 13 cameras. You can see two here, four eye in the front, uh, other cameras here. It has a supercomputer from NVIDIA in our own software where the car can drive on the track by itself. So the idea is maybe you have the money to buy such a car, but maybe not the skills. Skills don't come with money necessarily. And you go on a track and the car can show you uh, how to drive it properly. So it shows you autonomously how a race car driver will drive it on the track and then it can help you to reach that level yourself. So it, we call it the driver coach because it coaches you to be a better driver. Um, and uh, what we are also quite proud of is that because of all of these capabilities in the car with the motors, with the uh, self-driving system and so on, we can endlessly develop it and send software updates to the customers it has all the air software updates so you always get a better car and we just started production last year started first deliveries <coughs> in our new factory in zagreb uh, we will produce 150 cars so it's limited to 150 cars and now we have also showroom here in belgium uh, in uh, with uh, ditaven with our partners and uh, the first uh, Nevera delivered to, to Belgium will also be delivered in the next few months or within this year. So we have just started with this car, um, yeah, building it in this beautiful facility in Zagreb. We'll do a lot of crazy stuff like breaking a lot of records in the months to come. Um, and the point is to show really what electric cars are about and that we don't, like enthusiasts that love cars, that we don't need to be afraid of the future but look forward for the future. And that's our motto. We want to make the future exciting. Uh, so thank you for being part of the journey here. I hope you, you like the car. Uh, I invite you to uh, have a look at our YouTube a little bit uh, to see what crazy stuff this car is capable to do. Uh, and I hope you enjoy the show here. Thank you so much.